Hello ladies and germs, it's Joker here, and today is moving day. We are finally going to move off that tiny little island and move into a warehouse. Well at least my stuff's moving into the warehouse. Anyway, but before we get and I show you that, I have a couple of things around the world I want to show you. I did the roof down here, I am still moving sheep in. Um, I may replace this with the red nether brick, just because I think that looks a little bit brighter. And then if I come up here, I've been doing lots of work, and I did promise you guys that I'd have this done for next episode, is the story system for... Excuse me, bogey boy! Get lost! I don't know where he spawns, probably that dead corner. But yeah, uh, wheat, uh, beetroot and the seeds, uh, potatoes and carrots all go in there. And then here I'm going to have three sugarcane farms. Um... And then this one will be sugarcane storage. Here and here is going to be filled up of hay bales. Right then. So next thing I have to show you is the iron golem farm. Now I did get that up and running. Uh, which I was actually very surprised about. Like I didn't think it would work. But apparently you actually have to be in um, so many blocks of the iron golem farm for it to work. And when I originally did it, I brought the collection area down to Y63, um, which is not, uh, sorry, ideal. So I made a little cave, so I can just bring my boat straight in here, and crash into every rock on the way by the looks of it. And then if we run up here is the actual collection system, as you can see, I have been using it um i've been afk in here at night so like I, and i have been using it for the hoppers and stuff because the storage system over at the uh farm is extremely expensive and then i decided i'm just going to put an afk fish farm here with my fishing rod um i have got to go through all of them at some point um I've tried to hide the lighting as best I can, but so that no mobs will spawn. But what I'm finding is mobs are actually falling off the mountain here. Yeah, it's a bit of a problem. Right, I think I've got one more thing to show you, possibly two. So, um, it's yeah, let's come over to the fishing shop. Ah, look at that gourd. We need a name for that ship. Like, guys, in the comments, like, give me a name, like, and I'll choose the best one, and whoever give it gets a shout-out on next, uh, say next week's episode. I still need to do the cannons on it. Or I could have done that today, actually. Right, let's go under the bridge here. A lovely bridge that was full of mobs the last time I come up here. Right. Left. So, I've been slightly working out the paths, not hugely... Um, this is where the warehouse will be, so we will get to that very shortly. But, I decided to redo the crane. And the reason I've redone the crane is it just looked too modern. Now it actually looks a bit more um, medieval. More like it's used with ropes and pulleys. Let me just go up there and show you a little bit more closely. I am aware that this episode is getting on a bit so um after this i will then start the time lapse of the thing so yeah you can't really see it that well but there's your counterweight there and then if you come around here you can see that that's the oh my god i thought i was dead i actually thought i was dead but that's the arm um, as if i still haven't replaced those fences I've, i'm so dis so, anyway, ladies and germs, this is not getting this warehouse built. I'm also going to integrate the um, crane into the build, so this part will be like a courtyard, which this will then move stuff around the courtyard for the uh, warehouse. Zombie, shut up! Right, so, without further ado, run that time-lapse.
So, ladies and germs, that is the uh, outside of the building built anyway. But we have a small issue of the mob kind. So, I'm going to get the supplies for that. Oh, actually, up here looks lovely. This is exactly the type of vibe I wanted. Lovely. So. Oh, no, 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 not again. You're not killing me again. No. No, 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 no. Yes. I am all powerful. You cannot be feed me. Anyway, ladies and germs, I'm going to grab my next lot of supplies and I'll be back with you and I'll do that in a time lapse as well. <laughs> Ladies and germs, it is done. I am sorry about the torch spamming, but the last place that I want mobs is in my warehouse because this is where we are moving to. So, uh, oh hello, we've got a mob. We've got a mob party here. Hey. Anyway, I'm gonna have to do something about that. Uh, maybe a redstone contraption or something. Anyway, before I get yeah, so this is where I'm going to be putting all the stuff. Now, up here isn't actually anything important. I just wanted to make it look like this warehouse is actually being used for something. So, I still have that area and that area there to cut out. So, it looks like that when the crane takes the wood and the rocks and stuff off the ships, it will then drop them off in the courtyard of this place. Then the little cranes at the front will then pick them up, pull them in, put them here. And I don't know if you guys know, but I found a medieval saw. And this is a bit bigger than you'd expect. But it's about the best I can come up with in Minecraft. So, there is only one thing left to do. And that is... Kill this guy. No. The last thing to do is to go and get all our stuff. So, for one last time today, run that time lapse. So, ladies and germs, as you just saw by that, I have moved most of my stuff over here. I do have to reorganise it because, unfortunately, it is a bit of a mess, but we will get to that in another episode. But, anyway, I do hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, please hit that like button for me, and if you've really enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe. It really helps the channel out and really makes me more motiv motivated to make these videos. Anyway, I've been Joker, and I will see you in a mini-money-mo. Bye.